Welcome to our Student IT Support How to Set Up Your Microsoft Authenticator video. In this video, we're going to show you how you can set up your Microsoft Authenticator for your student account through Latrobe University. Please note, for use in this video, we always recommend using two devices to set up your Microsoft Authenticator. One of these devices should be your mobile phone. So first things first, we're going to try and log into, say, your Outlook, LMS or Student Online account. So first thing you're going to do is enter your student username. So this will be your student ID number at students.ltu.edu.au. Then just pop in your password like you normally would. Okay, so now we're going to come up with our Microsoft Authenticator page. So now it says more information required, we're just going to select the next button. From here, our first step is going to be downloading this app on your phone. So either go to the Play Store or the Apple Store. And then you're just going to search up Microsoft Authenticator. Now make sure the picture of the app matches the one you saw on the screen before. So the blue lock with a little blue person. Now that that's downloaded, we're just going to go to the next page. Now ensure you have notifications on and then we're going to go through how we add them. So we're going to open our Authenticator app, click the little plus symbol, click work or school account, and then we're going to hit the next button on our computer. Now we're going to scan that QR code that we see on our screen in our Authenticator app. So back on your phone, you're going to click the scan a QR code option and scan the QR code that was on your screen. This is going to activate the account and put it into the Authenticator. Now you can see there it's been added successfully. So now we're going to hit the next button on our computer screen again. Now we've got a number on there, that's the one we're going to pop in our phone. So in your phone you'll get a notification come up and you'll just enter that number that we saw before and then select yes. This is going to approve that notification. So back on your computer screen it should load and say notification approved and then you can select the next button. Now that the account's secure you can select done and this is just going to log you straight into whatever account you were trying to access.